hello guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to uh share some opinion with you guys again this is just my point of view i am not an advisor i am i i actually it's just something that i'm thinking about and i just wanted to share it with you guys okay so if you guys like this video don't forget to hit the subscribe button below share the video uh give it a thumbs up also leave a comment down below because I would love to know what you guys think <clears throat> about what I am actually talking about, okay? So, people often said that uh, men love a woman who knows how to cook, clean, a woman who is loyal, a woman who is submissive, modest, all type of good stuff, right? And they said that men want a woman that they can say she's my ride or die, one is uh, she is my backbone, whatever. So we use all these terms just to show that men love a woman who actually he can actually count on, right? A woman that he can trust, a woman that will make him real happy and the women that he knows that if something were to happen she's not just gonna bail out on him or anything like that but she's going to stay strong and do whatever she do suits to just sustain the family and keep the family whole and family family together now i am here to say no I, I don't I don't believe in this anymore. Maybe then I was, but now I don't because um I don't believe that any woman can keep a man who doesn't want to be kept. It doesn't matter what you do, it doesn't matter if you cook, it doesn't matter if you clean, it doesn't matter if you if you uh, 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 um say yes to everything, it doesn't matter if you humble as hell. I just feel like men is going to stay when a man wants to stay, period, bottom line. Because if a man wants you, there's nothing in this world that can keep that man away from you. huh? Also, if that man doesn't want to be with you, there's nothing that you can do to actually make that man stay. Yes, he might still like, oh, he might come back because there's something about you that make him feel good. There's something about you that make him feel alive. But if the man, if, if in his mind, in his heart, it doesn't want to stay, it doesn't matter what you do, he will not stay. Because um because think about it like you you a lot of women are single as much as there's a lot of men who out there single right but if i'm pretty sure that there are men out there who met women before that actually do all that because but in their mind, they feel like they're not ready. In their mind, they feel like they're not settling. They're not compromising. They're, they're, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm really using the right word, but what I'm saying is this. If a man wants you, no matter what it is, it doesn't matter if you don't cook. It doesn't matter if you don't clean. It doesn't matter because at the end of the day, most men nowadays know how to cook. Most men nowadays knows how to clean. So if a man wants you, if he wants to be with you, he doesn't want anything from you. He loves you for who you are. He loves you for how he feels about you. He loves you for, for the person you are, how you make him feel, how comfortable he is, he uh, the, the peace of mind that he gets. And he's voluntarily, willingly saying that this is my rock. This is my woman. This is my best friend. No matter what I am staying. But when a man don't want to be with you, it doesn't matter if you're very good to him. He's going to love you. He's going to respect you for what you do. He's going to appreciate it. He's going to, you know, 
feel comfortable around you. But if you're not the woman that touch his soul, if you're not the woman that make him feel like, oh my God, that's what I want, he's not going to stay. So don't stress yourself, ladies. Do not stress yourself over a man that doesn't want to be with you. Do not stress yourself over a man that don't want to keep you. Because at the end of the day, you're wasting your time. You're wasting your time. Because it doesn't matter how much you're trying to tell this man you love him. It doesn't matter how much you're trying to prove this man you love him. It doesn't matter how much sacrifice. It doesn't matter how loud you shout it out. It, he's not going to hear it. He is not. It's just that he, he can't hear it. He can't feel it because in his mind, you're not the one that he wants. In his heart, he is not thinking like that about you. He doesn't see you that way. So a good coochie, a good cook, it doesn't matter how special you are in bed. It doesn't matter how good you cook, you clean, this man is still not going to stay unless he himself, he wants to stay. So ladies, get with a man who wants to be with you. Get with a man that wants to spend a life with you. A man that is willing to to stay, a man that's willing to work hard and be with you. A man that you can count on. A man that's not going to bail out on you. A man that's not going to disappear just because you are imperfect. A man that's not going to judge you for everything that you do. The way you raise your children. The way you dress. The way you talk. Everything you do is wrong. Because at the end of the day, he just not for you. At the end of the day, he just not the one. So... I am speaking based on what I feel, how I see life, because um, most of people get together and they feel like, oh, they're so in love. Oh, they this and they that. And at the end of the day, like to me is that if you really, really, really love a person, there's no reason to go. If you really love a person, why not putting this energy to work for that relationship? Instead of putting all of this negative energy, all of these uh, uh, drama, you know, why don't you put that same energy to actually work towards that relationship, huh? Why can't we just get alone and talk about it and just make it work? I don't believe in... Oh, I love you, but it just is it, it doesn't work. It's not going to work. Why? Why? I don't believe in that. I believe that if you really love the person, you will put the work that you have to put in that relationship to make it work, right? Think about what you do every day in a daily basis. Think about it. As a person, you wake up in the morning. What do you do? You wake up, you get dressed. Whatever you do in life to make your little money, to pay your bills, you get up. You make sure you get up in the morning to try to make that end means, right? You're trying to make that money, right? So you don't just not go to work. You, it doesn't matter how cold it gets outside. It doesn't matter the storm. It doesn't matter what it is. You have to get out on the road to trying to make money. Yeah? Because you know, when the bills come, they're not going to pay themselves, right? When you need this car, you need, you say, oh, I want this car. I want this. Whatever you want in life, what do you do? You work hard to make sure you, you, you save money and you, 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 if you got a cut in your, on your, on your expenses, like if you were the, the type of person who eats out a lot, or if you, if you spend a lot of money on clothes, unnecessary stuff, you stop that. 
you slow down in the way that you spend money for food, the way you spend unnecessary money for like clothes and shoes and going out and stuff like that. Just because you working so hard because you want that new car, you working so hard because you want that new house, you working so hard because you want something. So it's the same thing. I mean, I am comparing human being with materialistic things, but it's the same thing. When you want something, you work hard for it. So there's nothing good in life that's easy. Everything that is meaningful, that is worthy, that is good for you, it takes a lot of work. It takes devotions. It takes understanding. It takes patience. It takes all of that. So if you love someone... You're going to spend the necessary time that's needed to learn about this person, to get to know this person, to understand what makes this person mad, what makes this person angry, uh, I mean, happy, you know, and you're going to to uh, 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 discuss things and improve the, you know, out, the way you guys communicate, the way you guys do things, because that's your person, because that's the one that you want to be by your side. That's your best friend. You don't want that to just fade away and then just like give up on that. Now, when you love somebody truly, you don't just give up. When you love somebody, you don't just say, hey, it is what it is. No, as much as if you want something, when you work so hard for this car, you finally get that car. You work like years and years to save money to get this car. What do you do when you get it? You take care of it. When you drive it, you try not to put it like a pothole. When you when you uh, 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 um, you make sure you do service, so you check the tires, you check the oil, you make sure you you check everything so that the car can stay stay uh, uh, in good condition right so the car don't give you any trouble anytime soon you keep maintaining that car because it's like damn i love this car i work so hard for this car you bought a new house what do you do you pay the taxes you cut the grass you you mow the loan you do you you know you you remove snow when it's snow. You put the heat when it's cold. You protect what you love. You protect what you work so hard for. So I believe that the reason why you do this is because you want to keep this house. The reason you do that is because you want to keep this car. So if a man is with you, if he wants to be with you, he is going to work with you. He is going to understand you, your love language. He's going to communi try to communicate with you hmm? to try to work that relationship. So as long as you yourself as a woman, the door, you open that door for him to communicate with you. As long as you as the women, you love this man just as much as this man wants you. Yes, if he wants to stay, he will stay. Now, if a man wants to stay and the women don't want him to stay, that's different. But if you love a man and he doesn't want to stay, honey, there's nothing you can do to keep him. Doesn't matter what you do, baby. You can be loyal, like I said already. You're not going to keep him, honey. You can just tell him every day how much you want him. You can tell him every day how much you can't live without him. You can cry. He's not going to hear you. You can cry. He just doesn't care. He just doesn't care because at the end of the day, you are not what he wants. And it is so sad because, you know, we often reject the people that love us. <laughs> often, it's like, you go chasing after someone that doesn't love you we often go towards the people that doesn't give a 
flying F about us. But the man that would absolutely give everything for you, you don't love him. The man that would sacrifice for you, you don't love him. The man that would do anything to protect you, to love you. The man that would just lay down his life. Just give it to you like it means nothing. You don't want him. Hmm. But you want, unfortunately, you love another man. Think about it, ladies. Think about it. When you see a man, hmm, a man that you don't want, it doesn't matter what he does. You don't want him, right? It doesn't matter how good he makes you feel. He is not the one. It doesn't matter how genuine. It doesn't matter how loving. It doesn't matter how happy he, he try to make you. If you don't love him, if you do not see him that way, it's useless. Whatever he does don't mean nothing. Think about it, ladies. It's the same way. It's the same way. The same way you cannot see this man that's going crazy for you. You can't see it. You can't feel it. You can't. It's the same way. It's just the other way around. Instead of you can't see him, he can't see you. So stop blaming yourself. Stop stressing yourself over it. Just move on. Find someone. I mean, it's not easy to just move on and find someone when you love somebody. <laughs> Speaking of experience, I know it's not. It is so hard when you're actually so in love with one person. You can't just get up and walk away. I get it. I get it. But I think we have to start telling ourselves it's time for us to leave. I think it's time for us to just wake up and stop dreaming and realize that we're wasting our time. Because this man will never love you. This man will not stay. Whatever that you do that make him feel good, he's just going to keep taking that. But you, that's all you're going to get. Maybe a booty call. That's it. Maybe a, a day of a good time. That's it. Because that man is not for you. He does not love you. He does not see you that way. So, this is my opinion. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm crazy for even thinking like that. But, stop beating yourself up. Stop. Because it doesn't matter what you do, honey. Trust me. You ain't keeping him. <laughs> if he doesn't want to be kept, you won't keep him. He will run. He will find a way to leave you. Because, honey, you are not the one that he want to be kept by. So, I hope you guys like this video and I would love to know your opinion about it and by leaving a comment down below and um, if you think I'm right give me a thumbs up give me that thumb up if you think I'm wrong let me know all right so share this video lovelies I hope you guys had a very, very, very Merry Christmas and um, 
Stay blessed and happy. Keep your chin up. God love you. And I love you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Good night.